Alright everyone, and we're back to Let's Play Alan Wake, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. So we're still running away from the other cops. Right. Poor Alan, he's having a rough couple days, isn't he? All he wanted to do was go on vacation. Just so I could be thrown to some doctor and be inspired for writing. Yeah, ah oh, shit. Aren't these a lot of fucking cops for this just being like a little hick town? Well, never mind, they're um... It's the FBI, that's why. Throw fucking flares? Damn. Didn't that take my frames for a second there? Damn. Let's get up here. I think I lost him. And hey, what's that, a manuscript? He's gone. Come on, guys. We need to head him off. Whoop, whoops, wrong button. Sweet. Oh, uh, not shadowy people, please. Whoa, shit. Maybe one of them has a gun. I didn't hear no. I tried. Light. Drop hazard. Ah! Oh. oh, he's shooting a flare over here. Whoa, what the fuck? Random crater. Oh, they're gonna get killed. Yeah, they're dead. Oh well. Apparently it's Andy. Uh, hey, another car. This horror was everywhere I went, circling me. The cops didn't stand a chance. They were after a writer, not a monster. <laughs> he wears a tweed jacket. Ah ha ha, there's no way he could be tough. Uh oh, there's a helicopter somewhere. Whoa! Play Metal Gear. Oh, come on. Damn, the birds fucked it up. There goes the helicopter. Damn. Hey, it's the gas station. Jump for joy. Uh, this is James Mulligan Thornton. Come in. Over. Uh, go 
Mulligan, over! Uh, we got Wheeler and Rose here. Wheeler's drunk or hopped up on something. Speaking of which, that fed had a pretty distinctive whiff of all the scotch about it. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. They got Barry. I don't have anything on that, Deputy Mulligan. Over. Well, whatever. Anyway, Rose is just being played here. here. You better get talking and take a look at both. Over. Gotcha. You better get them here quickly. Alright, just keep on strolling I down. I imagine that the broadcast tower in the distance was part of the local radio station. Maine seemed like a decent guy. Perhaps he could give me directions to the coal mine. Oh god. Unnatural shadows clung to the gate. <laughs> the darkness that was after me was trying to stop me. I wouldn't get through without a light. Oh damn. Alright, I'll go get a light. I mean I had to try, right? Oh damn a big light, okay. There was no power to the search line. Oh, fuck. Of course. There was coffee though. There we go, there's some power to the searchlight. Boom! Dark evil gate, be no more. You know, during these walking parts of just like me walking to the next event, there's not much to talk about because, oh shit, something went after me. There's not much really going on. At least I have a flashlight now, and that's all that matters. It took me a moment to recognize the flashbang grenades. They were an ideal weapon for my situation. Good thing that there's a fuck ton of flashbangs, huh? Assuming it works just like the uh, flares. Yeah, press I was gonna say I probably don't want to look at that, but okay. Don't want to blind myself. Whoa. Ha uh -huh. And here's another call. You're on KBFFM with Pat At least the guy's up in the tower. Or you know, nearby. Pat? What's on your mind, Mill? Well, I live near the trailer park, Pat, and there's a big ruckus going on over there. Well, that's just up the road from me. Hey, uh oh. Oh shit, okay. That guy's gonna totally kick the shit out of me. Try to not run too much, waste my stamina. Oh god, there's cops over here too. Oh no, it's just the, uh, the flashing light. Is he gone? 
because of the siren lights? Cool, maybe. Oh, nope. I don't want to waste all my flashbangs, especially for one guy. But I can keep doing that. Whoa! Get two big guys for the price of one. Oh, I hope Maine could lend me a car to get to the coal mine. That's hoping a lot. Oh yeah, just give me a car. But okay. Wake. How did he open that? Oh, I'm so glad you could find the time to do this, Mr. Wake. No way to run now, Danny Brown. You got away from me. Don't hurt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Everyone calm down. Put this gun down. We're all friends here, right? Cool your jets, Nightingale. We got him. What the hell's the matter with you? There's a civilian in there. Uh, which is the coal mine? I had fallen off so many cliffs it was ridiculous. <laughs> That's what you get for naming a book the sudden stop. It was probably good I hadn't had the chance to tell Maine where I was going. I'd have to lose the cops and find my own way to the mine. Almost missed that. Oh well. Off to the mine then. Still no gun, by the way. I saw a generator. Okay, I did. I would have just turned this bad boy on, but then they would just beat the shit out of me, so I will flashbang. Oh, come on, that's not fair. Damn. You want to camp the, the car? Okay. I guess I could have done that. The darkness controls the taken. Yeah, blah, 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 darkness. Shotgun. Whoa, shit. Okay, then, fuck it. Oh, come on. Ugh. Shit. 
Sound and Fury. Come on, get a little bit closer. Come on. Just another house? That is the one I was in. In light, you can hurt them. Thanks! I've only played how much of the game? Just for that little tip. What's in here? Coffee. I see something else over here. It's not the correct way I'm supposed to go, but... Oh wait, no, never mind. I just came from there. For some reason it looked a little different because it's all lit up this time. In white, eerie, foggy light. Or something. Let's get this page. And... Go for the next episode. Thanks for watching.